Okay guys, so right now we're cooking. We're about to make tacos. Abby's cutting mangoes. So I make this mango sauce and I can't eat my tacos at all right now. Um, Piss Max, guys. Um, so yeah, the kitchen is a mess, so don't mind the surroundings. We literally just got home. Um, and we're just, we just got straight into this because guys, we're starving. We wasn't even supposed to do a mukbang. Mm -hmm. But you know, might as well, right? So this is a mango process. Um, Alright guys, so Abby just finished the chicken. Looks a little She's dry. frying the tortillas. And then, then here we have guac, some pico, and the mango sauce that Abby makes. Mmm. <laughs> What's up, Migos gang? We are hungry. It's and we are so hungry, guys. We're guys. Starving. It's like a late night. It's like 12.01 right now, guys. And we are just we're starving. So like that. Like, I can't wait. I really can't wait. And you're just going to really watch this chop. Yeah, I don't even know if I'm going to talk about anything. Probably off them that I even. Need, I just need a little, like, little sweet. <laughs> mm. I have my power right downstairs. What's wrong with me? Yo, I left. I forgot to do the beans, but at this point, mm. <sighs> I noticed that I like everything tiny. So this thing, I gotta shred it more. I don't like big chunks. Like starving is not even the word like right now. Like I'm hungry. Like this is gonna be more go ASMR. To, if you ever go to sleep with this pain. Yeah, this is painful. This is so painful. I'm in a rush. Just a cheese that I'm mean, having really because it's gonna take up mad time. Yeah. I'm in a rush, literally. Once I get like this whole talk this one taco in my mouth, then I think I'll be good. I can breathe. What am I missing? Sauces. This sauce right here. Yo, that thing's fire. Where you get that at? Stop and shop. It's weird. It's like this is the only way I can get it to come out. I hate when shit's like dirty on top. I the juices. I hate that. Damn, you know what I should have got? Tabasco sauce. I should have got it from the fridge. I can get it. Isn't that... What's that? That's, that's fucking ghost pepper. That's just not spicy. Oh, I'm going in for my first bite. Let me see that cheese, yeah. Oh, I didn't even put cheese. <laughs> the cheese I'm gave me And that it. cheese looks expensive. It actually looks so expensive. Real big cup. There you go, guys. I'm old DJ this right now. Holy shit. Whoa guys. It's so quiet. Look at me. I'm so dehydrated. Mmm. 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 I feel like the camera's like, supposed to be more that way. I don't care. Mmm. There we go. At this point, even. Mmm. My God, this is not. It's not by the paprika. I'm so proud of myself. We could have went more food. And we figured it out for the free. 
Yeah, I was ready to eat anything. I need to it's just a little bit. I'm going to take a little bit. It's not a lot. I don't think you have another juice. You don't. Yeah, I'm going to drink water. Here, here. Mm, I need to get the later. I could drink water too. Just take some juice. That's the way you got this. Let me get the Tabasco. That's the second one I'm gonna take. Oh my god. I need the Tabasco lady. Cause it's Chipotle. Sorry guys. Maybe no. I'm hoping you guys are enjoying this because we're sharing it right after ten minutes. But because we're just eating because we're so hungry. Like we're like <laughs> we're like two um wolves right now. Two wolves. Hungry hippos, nigga. It's like late and we're just starving and we're like looking. Two hours. I've been eating at this time. Like this mm -hmm. is the time I get mad hungry now. Like it's exactly this time, like twelve. Mm -hmm. I don't know why. Like hungry when you want to devour. You know when I wake up, I don't want to do nothing. Nope. Not even like later or anything. It's like this exact time. I'm mm -hmm. starving at this time. So this is it indifferent right now. This is like for the whole day. My stomach is still growling right now. Yeah, like this. That was uh, that wasn't even a tease. My stomach is growling. I really love that sauce, and I gotta get it. That habanero. That shit's good. That shit just looked good when I. Just looked at it. Mm. In my mind, this is telling me that this is more chicken, and it's really the same. <laughs> oh my god! And I like everything spicy. Oh my god! Jesus, thank you for this food. Bless those who are without right now. I was seeing, now I could talk a little bit. I was seeing the Oprah Winfrey show today, like mm -hmm. of back in the day. And there was this lady that adopted these boys, four boys. And again, she was starving them to death. The oldest one was like 30 pounds and he was 19. Oh, and the neighbor, was starving them, so, huh? she was starving them. And the neighbor, um, the neighbor caught the 19 year old digging in the trash and the he called the police like there's a there's a little eight-year-old okay? there's a little eight-year-old digging in the trash can like the person calls him like that's unacceptable and the kid was really 19 and you could hear the the name one call him saying he can't be more he can't be older than 10. that's how skinny he was and it was him and his his brothers she was and he said like they were on the um oprah show talking they probably did they go to school or anything? Yup, they went to school and one of them told this teacher to please give him food because he was so hungry and she didn't believe him. She just told the mom, which put him in punishment. Yep. Oh nah. And she was just they said that when she was like in a good mood, she'll like she'll tell them, Alright, you got one minute to eat this and she'll give them pancake batter and raw oatmeal. And this is her own kids? No, she adopted them. So she adopted them to be cruel for the money. Is that I'm guessing? Yep. A stupid ass bitch. Four little boys. 
Nope, they were black, and the lady was black too. No, no, no. And, and she used to go to church and stuff, and like, and the, for the church, for church time, she used to put, um, like a lot of layers of clothes on them. The, the, the oldest one was probably like 10, and he weighed as much as a two-year-old's kid. Like 23 pounds. Whoa, that is just psycho. And they only gave her four years in jail. She was killing them. She was killing them slowly. Imagine all four boys suffering. Them little boys suffering for years. That's why, like, DCYF be on top of the kids once they're, um, when they're with the people. But once they're, um, they take them, like, adopted, they gotta keep following up. Because mm -hmm. that's not funny. Like, that's ridiculous. Wow. Mm-hmm. Did they go on the show? Three of them did. Mm -hmm. Dude, it was like... By the time it was the court date, where they were testifying, mm -hmm. they were already 100 pounds more. That's how hungry they were. Que eso se comieron de todo. And that was only like 30 days. From they the probably only ate at school. If you really think about it, they yeah. probably did only eat at school. Mm -hmm. And probably snuck stuff in their backpack. Oh. I'm so hungry, like, I'm nervous. Like, that's just crazy. And for the teacher not to believe the kid. I know the teachers she should get fired. Teachers be like like they just be so mean to these kids. They are, they like grouchy. Like they I like hate them. Like there's this one teacher that like helps out and like she's always in a bad mood. Like, yo, don't take them. Man. They just be mad grouch. Just to save the meaty. I know some kids are annoying, but like. When they're annoying, I treat them annoying. When they're nice, well, I treat them nice. Right here. <laughs> like, I be like, chill out when they're annoying. I be like, chill, calm down. Take, go take a five minute break. It's crazy how we all have different things when this can be the same thing as a napkin. And the fact that you gotta pay for it, it pisses me off. You gotta pay for something that's gonna you be throw away. Trash. But what about trash? We pay we pay for bags that are going in the trash. Like that's trash. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. That should be free. It really should be free. Come with the trash bins. Imagine they start charging do they charge for trash bins? Yeah. Okay. The trash bins? They charge for those? Like the ones the the city ones? Mm-hmm. No, they I don't. think like if you want more of them, those ain't free. Wow. Mhm. Mm That's crazy. My favorite sauce. They're really starting to charge for bottles. Yep. In some states, that's regular. Um. Well, but here it's definitely not regular. Like, obviously, certain places, like, Whole Foods is always going to be, like... What they should put like, here is pump your, um, pump somebody pumping your gas. Yo, flat. That's only in Jersey. Because I'll give a tip. This one? Mm -hmm. This one. I'll give a tip all day. Because so I'm not trying to get out of my car when it's cold. I'm not trying to get out of my car. You don't want to pop? But low key, even if we had that, I'll still be like, nah, forget it, because I don't feel like giving him my two dollars. For a tip. Cheap. And it's and if, if I see somebody putting pumping my gas and they're freezing, I, I can't just give them two dollars. I'ma feel I too know. bad. Yeah. So we're better off just doing that again, so. 
Well, I'm still like starving. Yep. Dad, where is this food going? This is my third one. And I feel the same. Let me drink some water or something. Why am I hungry? Not some more chips or anything. Well, it's my food, so. I eat until there's no more. Crazy that the teachers didn't know that these kids were being like abused, though. Yep. Like, how can you be so? But this happened like ten years ago. Like not long ago. I feel like now this world is so sensitive that they call DCYF for breathing. That 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 that, that won't happen. As soon as the kid tells me they're hungry at home, we having issues. Yep. I'm reporting the shit out of you. I don't give a shit. Like, I'm reporting. Like, that's why. Like, if a child's hungry, there's mad extra food. Yo, you wanna take it home? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you be seeing some of the parents that they be like, oh, um, yeah, take a dinner because I'm not cooking. That shit pisses me off. Be like, are you kidding me? That shit pisses me off. I will. You know what else pisses me off? When the um parents pick up kids and their coats are not on. What does it take you two minutes to help your child put his zipper up mm -hmm. so he won't be sick? And I be embarrassing each parent. Excuse me. Like, um, no, come here. Mm -hmm. I will tuck, I, I tuck each kid. I tuck them all. With their little gloves, their hats, their hoodies on top of their hats. Like, it's mad cold outside and their bitch is abierto. I know I embarrass the parents today 100% okay. Right, cause from little kindergarten, she has like um, picture or whatever, and I see her neck. Her neck is dirty, and she's a pretty little little girl. And I'm like, what? I'm like, okay, maybe she has eczema or something. So I, I asked him like, like I talked to the brother because she's like too little to even know. Mm -hmm. I'm like, does she still have eczema? She goes, no. I'm like, okay. And then I asked the girl, I'm like, you take a shower by yourself? He goes, yeah. I'm like, okay, make sure when you shower, you scrub your neck. And I told the mom, I was like, I was like, yes, I guess so. And she goes, yeah. I'm like, so then it gave me bad. I said, if she has eczema first, I didn't want to be super rude, but. I know she's like, no, so, eso, eso, eso es la familia de nosotros. But I didn't see her neck was like that, though. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> if your child needs to scrub her neck. La familia de tu no, usted lo que de una de cuida, doña. Póngase lo suyo, que esa niña no debe estar con un cuello sucio. I know I embarrassed her. Try to be a trigate. Oh my. Today I'm just gonna. Oh deep. Maybe trigate. No me pasa vergüenza. Trigate when you go to the bathroom. Trigate, cacaros, sucia. No, no. Mm mm. She got a neck or something. No, because you know when you have fake chains. No, she's not even overweight. Nothing. No, because you know when you're like, then you like, you have to like go in between, but like, <laughs> bro, that's unacceptable. Like, How your you? your children, the way they are and what they look like is a reflection of who you are. I know that when I have kids, go to your person. Because I'm not going to have time in the morning. To get myself cute, because I'm gonna take all the time for my child. Mm -hmm. And if I gotta go every Saturday or every Friday to go get my son a haircut, that's what we doing. If the dad doesn't take them, I cannot stand when little kids have no haircuts and the dad is all spiffied out on point. Take your son. Yep. Take your son. You see the moms coming in with their Uggs and their this and their that. And, and the this. kid dusty. The child is dusty. With big clothes. Like, that shit gets me so freaking mad. The only two that I think, I'm not going to say names, obviously. But you know the two? The two boys? Mm -hmm. Um, Those two, they're always on point. With their clothes. Clean. Todo bueno. 
Mm. Doesn't even match the parents because the parents don't look that on point. But the kids are on point. That means when they go to the store, they go straight to the kids section first. Yep. Because can't have, be having your kids out here with looking crazy. Yes, I'm not going to put my child with their... Like in elementary school, like I'm, you're not wearing your best sneakers. I'm no. sorry, not to go to elementary. Not, not to go ruin them. Not to go. I be seeing these kids shoot, and like, thank God that I like. We work where we can like see these things because if if I didn't, I would have been like, yeah, my kids, kids always yep. going. No, I'll put them not in elementary little, school. Cute little shoes. I'll get them some bands. Yep. Bands. Easy wash. That's what you're gonna be in. Vans, two pairs. Because, yo. If I tell you these kids, they ruin their shoes in one day. And by the time I have kids. In one day. They, this shit, this shit is messed up. I was playing outside with, with my friend. And then, and we, and then. And then they just rub the shoe against the concrete, like. And but I'm gonna teach. And they don't I'm, tie their shoes. I'm gonna teach my child. You come with them dirty shoes. You're gonna see what's gonna happen. Cause you're gonna, you're gonna come here with some light up shoes. <laughs> and if you're a kid like Jay, Stacy's son, you're gonna be very livid to have light up shoes. That's, that's cause that's not that's. Mean. I was like Jay here, and he's like, No, he didn't. No, he knows. He knows about his shoes. I'm point. He can't be dirty. He can't be wet. None of that. That's not happening. He knows already. He knows way too much. Um, what's it called? And there's gonna and if you like your light up shoes, mm -hmm. nobody's talking about the light up shoes because it's like I'm. We're just talking about like if they didn't like them. Yeah, if they if they didn't like them, I'm not coming at anybody. And yeah, I'm gonna shoes. put them the opposite of what they like. If they don't learn how to take care of what they want, because they gotta learn that from an early early age that. <laughs> <laughs> Peace. <laughs> you said ten minutes. Why do we talk so much? We're talking like people are in bad <laughs> That's embarrassing. <laughs> We got no friends. <laughs> We're talking like you guys is dead there. Like we having a whole conversation. <laughs> Cause we already know what we're gonna say. That's crazy. <laughs> That's real crazy. How is it from 10 minutes that was, We about to be at 30. Is this we're gonna be at an hour because I'm not getting up. <laughs> That's what's crazy. Maybe we can cut the silent parts. That's a good idea. Oh, there's barely any. Honestly, when we have videos like this, I don't go through it. <laughs> I just got the beginning and the ending. That's if I remember that you can do that. <laughs> I'm trying. I be thinking like, yo, did we say something crazy? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. Let me just... I be dead trying and I be like, man, we're just talking and talking and talking. Mm. If not, and if I do cut, I'm going to cut the randomest part. I'm not gonna know what I'm cutting. I'm just gonna cut, 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 cut. Bye. But pretty much this book bang is just about take care of your kids. Feed take them. care of your kids, yo. Groom them, bathe them. Don't have them if you can. Like, yeah, because parents be dead heated that they got kids. Now, Hurry up! Put your coat on. Hurry up, I gotta go, hurry up, I gotta meet him. Hurry don't up. do it for no guy, don't do it for no girl. Do it for yourself if you wanna try. Like, and you really have to, it has to be for yourself. Even though it's, and if you have one and you ain't ready for two, just stay with that one. It be the parents that can't with the one. That barely have a sitter. That be already having another one two years later. That don't know where the baby daddy's at. That just wanting to come and get more 
with another baby daddy. That ain't shit either. Take care of your kids, guys. That's it. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye.